Okay, so we have a DV6000 here. It was uh, sent in to us, said that it had no video um, and no wireless. Of course, we can't check the wireless because we don't have a driver to initiate it. But what we do notice is that we've turned the system on and we have uh, 0101 2006 and it's been running for 25 minutes we know that it's actually doing what it's supposed to do but we notice there is a CMOS battery attached to the board and it's actually plugged in so most likely in regards to our we have the registering of the memory proper processor we're going to say that our issue is probably linked to every time the uh, power is unplugged it loses the CMOS settings this is pretty common where you don't have the CMOS settings set and the say you unplug the CMOS battery and you plug your system in turn it on uh, post repair and it'll turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off, turn on, turn off, and then it turns on and it'll run, but you have issues with it. That is because it's trying to reset your uh, BIOS configuration settings for the lack of that uh, CWAS battery. So what we're seeing here is the system's actually working, everything's good with it, but uh, but you think we could unplug this like so and turn it back on and we would get a reset so let's see if I'm right could be completely wrong but uh, I'm pretty sure I may end up uh, being right on this one so we got a operating system not found it's because we they go into the CMOS quick enough. So we're going to push F10 and see if we can't get in. But it sinks the video. So. Well. Surprisingly enough, it's actually holding the settings. So. Perhaps I was wrong on that one. But, um. Huh. Won't be a first, but we'll just let it run for two or three hours and see where it goes and see what it does. We'll move this cursor down so that it can do what it needs to do. I'm still fairly certain that that battery may have something to do with it. It may be a weak battery uh, that just holds enough of a charge to do it, but... Um, <coughs> We'll check and see. We'll let it run for a little bit longer and see where it goes. Okay, so we came back into the office. We're checking the laptop. We see it's been run for three hours now. No issues. So, <coughs> our issue here is probably linked to the uh, battery as we stated before because even the battery could get a charge for being plugged in so what we're going to do is um, unplug everything and let it sit for a little bit um, by a little bit we mean let it sit for say oh an hour or two and we'll let it then we'll come back to it and see what happens. Leave everything plugged in like it is, and uh, we'll see what happens. So, system's unplugged, screen's off, laptop's off, and we'll see if the battery holds the charger if it resets back to where it was. Okay, so we're going to turn this one on. We will let it sit for a little while, and we're going to see if we get. Uh, 
if we get the uh, video going. Let's, I mean, let's see if we got it. Oh, doesn't seem to be doing it. Now, if we have a weak battery, that could explain things. Or just a... Uh, just a, uh, a, a doubtful that it's a reflow because it's running for so long like it is. Uh, typically it would have an error by now, but um, I mean, everything's running perfectly fine. What we're going to do is actually turn it off and let it sit. Uh, now, one thing that I did notice we've had this turned off for a while now and our timer for our actual uh, date and time here has not changed uh, it was at three hours before and we've actually come back quite a bit later and it's still sitting at three hours and something now I know that that's that's not going to be right. I mean, I've had two customers, and uh, I'm just of the feeling that this is this still may be a CMOS battery issue. What I'm going to do is let this stay unplugged for a considerably more amount of time, and uh, we'll actually unplug it, take it, put it on the shelf, and then we'll go from there and see what happens. But for right now, I'm still going to say that it's a CMOS battery. Uh, and I'm going to check this time to make sure that this time has actually changed. Um, I'm of the mind that it's, uh, it was three hours and something before when I turned it off. And it's going to be three hours and something right now. So we'll have to go back and check and see what we find.